Dynamics AX is a great ERP system, and you probably don't think it could get any better, but it can because Dynamics AX leverages all of the other products within the Microsoft suite to extend the application outside of what the traditional ERP systems are able to do natively. In this overview, we will show you some of the ways that Dynamics AX leverages these products and how you'll be able to take advantage of them as well. The next area that we're going to look at is the integration with Microsoft Office. Almost all modern ERP systems have some sort of integration into the Microsoft Office products since it's the best productivity suite on the market. Usually this entails some sort of static download to a spreadsheet, but Dynamics AX takes this integration to a whole new level by not only integrating with Excel, but also with Word and uh, Microsoft Project and some other tools as well. So let's take a look at some of those and how they work. The first item we'll look at is really just a simple export from Dynamics AX out to Excel. Any time that you have a grid form showing up, then you can just click the Export to Excel button and it's going to push all of that information over to an Excel workbook for you. Now what makes this special though is the information hasn't just been cut and paste back into uh, from Dynamics AX. If you click on the Dynamics AX tab, then you can click on the fields and you can see all of the fields that were in the table that uh, you created the source from. And you can just go and drag any of these tables or fields up to the form and then close off the fields and then refresh this information and now you'll have the new information showing up here within the Excel spreadsheet. So this is almost like a mini report that you've created just through Excel. You can do something a little bit different here as well. If you want to just grab information from Dynamics AX then you can say I want to add a table and it's going to show you all of the tables within the system and we can filter this out and just choose a real table. That's going to go and create a link from the Dynamics AX table with full security so you can only see the information that you're allowed to see here within Excel and you'll have access to all of the ta table fields within the system. So now we can see that we have our customer table here and we can go and just add any of the fields, for example the cash discount, up to the table and then when we refresh this information then it's going to go and grab all of the information from the database here and put it into Excel. Where this is a little bit different is that now that I've gone and grabbed the information from the table then I can actually publish and update this information. So if I chose a customer and then chose a new uh, cash discount table here, so for example 1% in 7 days. Now that I've updated this, I can tell the system what to publish. And it's going to publish this table or any of the fields that I've updated and it's going to push that information back to Dynamics AX. If we click on this Dynamics AX status tab, then we'll also see a message as to how many records have been updated here within the view. The integration into Office isn't just uh, available within Excel, but it's also available with uh, other applications like Word. So with Dynamics AX, you can go out and create uh, mail merge files or mail merge like files within Word that link directly back to Dynamics AX and the Dynamics AX data. So here we can see that we've got our customer account and within Word we have also the Dynamics AX tab and we can see all of the fields that are associated with the customer as we saw with the other view. We can go down and we can even see that there's a link down here for a subtable for all of the customer transactions. You can go out and you can format these however you want and make them look as pretty or as formal as you want and what happens 
is that you can go and link these two transactions or two forms within Dynamics AX. For example, if I go into the sales and marketing area and go into my quotations, then in this case we've gone out and we've linked a Word document or a Word template here to our quotation. And if I wanted to print out a standard quotation uh, template for this um, record, then the Word document that we created is going to be used as the template, allowing us really to update the format and update the view without having to get a developer involved. So here you can see that the uh, Word document that we created is linked back to the record or the quote that we had in the system, and it's gone out and created that document for us. As a side benefit, then as I went out and I generated this document, then it also creates an attachment here and saves that away so that I always have access to it within the system. That's pretty cool. The final area that we'll look at with the Office integration is the integration into Microsoft Project. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go over to the Project Management and Accounting area and look at one of the projects that I've got set up here in the system. And Project is a great tool that allows you to go and manipulate the project plans and the project schedules really in a simpler way than the formatting that's delivered within Dynamics AX. So what you'll notice is that if you go to the Plan tab here and I click Open and Project, then that's going to open up the work breakdown structure that we've got configured here within our um, Dynamics AX project, and it's going to pull it all in, and it's going to show it to us in our Microsoft Project. Now we can see the project has been set up with all the milestones and with all the events, and if we want to, we can go and change these and change the dates and also add additional lines here. And just like with Word and Excel, then there's a Dynamics AX tab up here which allows us to publish this information directly back to Dynamics AX. So you can do all the manipulation here and then push it back into the system where it can be used for all the planning and all of the other functions that are associated with the projects. So that's a, that's a neat and nifty way to use one of the Office applications. So hopefully that's given you a good idea of some of the capabilities that we have within Dynamics AX when you reach out to the Office applications and also to the other productivity tools. There's a lot more that you can do and there's a lot more integration that's available to you. And if you have any questions or want to know any more information about anything that we've seen here, then just drop us a line at IBIS and we'd be more than happy to help you.